Hey everyone, Kobanermani456 here from another video. So yeah, today I'm giving you a news update. And the reason why I'm doing this news update on this channel is because this video I'm going to be doing is going to have a lot of trailers and stuff like that and video footage and it is just way too long for Kobe1 Kenobi456 because you know, I lost my 15 minute plus time limit on that when uh, that happened when Sega gave me a copyright strike. But uh, anyway, let's get on with um, Nintendo Direct. So uh, Nintendo had this huge conference yesterday talking about like upcoming plans for 3DS, talking about like the new firmware upgrade coming in uh, November. Then they also talked about some other features and talked about Mario Kart 7 a lot. So I um, really went into detail a lot of stuff and um, it was Japanese mostly, but we got um, some info about it. So uh, Mario Kart 7 is supposed to, like we've kind of heard, but they've basically confirmed it now. It's going to have 8 player online with 60 frames per second and also there's going to be a new community feature that allows players to create groups with other Mario Kart fans while setting up specific rules to make customized racing environments um, easily and then um, also there's um, Street Pass board that lets you exchange like scores, um, win and loss records, uh, coins that you've collected and other data in the game. And then um, also uh, Nintendo has confirmed that Hulu Plus is coming to 3DS and Wii. And um, also they have announced a new messaging system, which is probably one of the things that Nintendo has needed to put on the 3DS for a long time. They should have had that when they released the eShop, in my opinion. Actually, they should have released it when they had it at launch. But basically, the new um, thing is called Swap Note. And uh, you're able to like send 3D messages and stuff like that. And the messages you can send them via Spot Pass, and um, they'll get them. Um, your friends will get them instantly if they are online. If they aren't online, but they have Spot Pass enabled, like they have it on the wireless on, um, whenever they open their system up, then they'll get their message instantly. So kind of like on Nintendo Video, I guess you'd say, and other things like that, to where it'll send a notification to your 3DS if you have that wireless on, and then when you open it, oh, there it is. So yeah, and then um, also uh, you can send like photos and sounds and stuff like that with your messages, do little drawings, I think. Pretty cool. Um, there, I'll show a trailer at the end of this video. And then uh, also you can uh, swap messages with Street Pass and stuff like that. And then also the Nintendo Direct um, conference, they showed um, this new um, cowboy like Western game, I think wild like rolling western i can't even recall what it is but basically it's an armadillo in the game and he rolls around that takes out enemies and stuff like that and you do combos and stuff like that and it's coming for the nintendo 3ds eShop. so it should be 3d which is awesome sauce and nintendo finally needs to make some more but like first party titles for the eShop because you know um we just need some more content instead of just having like all the time virtual console games and dsi work games i want to see some 3d games and uh if you all don't exactly know what it could play like, well, um, from what I've heard from people who have actually played the demo before in the past, it's basically like Majora's Mask playing with the Goron basically the whole time. You roll around like in a, you know, in the armadillo shell and you take out enemies with it. It's pretty cool. Um, looks really interesting. The gameplay style looks fun. I think it'll be a great game for the 3DS eShop, which is something it desperately needs. Like. A game like that. Also, Nintendo has confirmed that Kirby's Adventure from the NES games is going to be a Nintendo 3DS Classic along with Kid Icarus, which is kind of interesting because, you know, Nintendo said that they had eight 3D Classics planned only. Maybe these were planned to be 3D Classics. I don't know. We'll see. But, um, you know, maybe they might have more. Maybe they have been working on more than we thought they would. And then uh, also Street Pass, two, um, Street Pass Quest 2 is coming. Um, then there's going to be Meat Plaza that's going to have like geographic locations, kind of giving a rough like idea. Um, and then also uh, there's going to be a new Find Me 2. So pretty cool. And then also one of the biggest things yesterday was about the 3DS video recording. So like I said, you can't record anything on your screen, like direct feed. Like it's not like um, an HD PVR or capture card or anything like that. It uses the 3D cameras on the outside of the 3DS. You can record videos. And not only that, you can also do stop motion videos, which is pretty cool. So if you have like a toy or something, as you see I saw in the trailer, like clay art, stuff like that, you can move it around and do stop motion videos. And then you have the ability to upload them upload them onto YouTube from what we heard yesterday. So that is pretty awesome. I'm definitely going to have some fun around with that and uh, you know, I mean, that'll be pretty cool to play around with stop motion and uh, you know, being in 3D and then uploading it onto YouTube, that's pretty sweet. So that and um, you know, that's basically it for uh, the news today. Um, 
don't have too much to say. I mean, channel update, nothing really. Um, just stay tuned for more Sonic Unleashed videos. Oh, let me know in the comments below if you would like me to upload more parts of Sonic Unleashed today because I won't be able to finish that walkthrough by the time Kirby Returns to Dreamland comes, like on October 24th, and that's when I'm going to start that walkthrough. I'm going to upload like probably three parts a day of that walkthrough. And then so far from what I've heard, the game has around like, six, it, you can beat the game in around like six hours or so. Um, and, uh, you know, I kind of explore and stuff like that, so maybe a bit longer for me, like seven hours or so. But, um, you know, I don't know if I'm going to do the extra unlockables or anything like that, or do the replay value in, the, in my walkthrough. I'm going to kind of see how the game plays overall. It should be pretty good, but I still haven't decided yet. So, um, if you want some more parts of Sonic Unleashed uploaded a day, let me know. Um, I know some people don't have the time to watch them all, and then some people do have the time and are like, Ooh, I love your videos. So, um, just let me know. I mean, whatever works for you all. Because um, whenever I do get Curry Returns to Dreamland, it might slow down with Sunk Unleashed videos. I might upload one video a day, but uh, my main focus will be Curry Returns to Dreamland. So, uh, yeah, that's basically it. So, um, thanks again. See ya. Oh, also check out mylikes.com. A uh, pretty cool website. You can do like Twitter, Tumblr. Facebook, YouTube, all that jazz. People ask me, um, does it actually cost or anything like that? And is it legit? Yes, it's legit. Le yes, it's legit, and it doesn't cost anything. It's free. You can make money. And um, a lot of people have said, uh, you know, it's just like a really good website. That's how I want my PS3 and stuff like that. So anyway, thanks. See you. Have a good day. 3 3D movie 撮影機能について ムービーの撮影ができるようになりました。ムービーは連続10分まで撮影できます。通常の撮影の他に、こだわりムービーとして、一定時間ごとに撮影するインターバル撮影。1コマずつ撮影する小間取り。ボタンを押して撮影を開